Jesse, God has commanded you to love your wife. Your leadership in this relationship should be characterized by love and sacrifice. That means that you're gonna put Sarah's needs before your own. It means that you will treat her with tenderness. It means that you will stay committed to Sarah for the rest of your life. Sarah, here the Bible teaches that in honoring Jesse as the husband and leader in your home, you're giving glory to God. You are by no means inferior to Jesse in any way, but God has given you a different role and a complimentary gift to your husband. And together, you will complete one another. They're my favorite flowers. They're my favorite I admire the love that you and Jesse share. Sarah, you take care of Jesse, you lift him up, and you bring out the best in him. I love seeing the way that you make each other laugh and smile. I can see that your love for each other is genuine. It's sweet and it's beautiful. I'm nervous to see Jesse. Really? Oh, I don't know why. Oh, <laughs> it makes sense. <laughs> I remember when we, we were probably about 16 or 17 years old and probably younger, and I remember Jesse telling me, he said, uh, you know, Sarah is the woman I love. I want to spend the rest of my life with her. And, you know, for more, most uh, 15, 16, whatever we were, that would just, you know, you call that puppy love. Like, you know, you're not really sure if it's going to go the distance, but when he said that, I, I, I knew that it was true. You flip it upside down. Sarah, I do want to offer to you that uh, I really am sincerely proud of you. I always have been proud of you. When, when I first saw you in the hospital, I thought, wow, this girl, I don't know what she's going to be. I hope she grows up to be smart and, and funny and, and, and just everything. And you have been. My heart is beating in my stomach. <laughs> That's not normal. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Vanessa. How are you? Oh, you look great. Thank you. You look awesome. Thank you. You look like a princess. Thanks. That's what I was going for. Wow. like it. Looks awesome. It looks great. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. I feel great. Yeah, no misses anything. <laughs> oh, wow. You look awesome. Thank you. You look really, really good. Thank you. I'm not as nervous anymore because no one's going to be looking at me. <laughs> you look really handsome. Thank you. You look beautiful. You ready? Yeah. Are you? I am. Dear Lord, thank you so much for this beautiful girl I have right here. I pray that no matter what happens today, that we'll have just an amazing day because this is the beginning of the rest of our lives and this commitment that we're making is no joke. And I'm fully ready and, and I know that she has been for a while. I, I th wanna thank you again for this beautiful girl and I pray that everything goes smoothly in your name. On behalf of the Bentley and Alum families, we just want to welcome you this afternoon as we celebrate the marriage of Sarah and Jesse. It's their desire to declare their love and commitment to each other publicly before you, their closest friends and family. Sarah Lynn, I've loved you for over six years. You are truly my best friend and I couldn't be happier to be here with you in this moment. You are so beautiful and in every way you are beautiful. When I look at you, I feel a sense of hope and peace for the future. Excited to experience life with you. 
I was blessed to be able to grow up alongside of you. And during that time, I've learned so much about who you are. I've learned that you are determined, you are hardworking, you're not afraid to take on a challenge. I've learned that you are one of the smartest girls I know, <laughs> with an almost perfect memory, but also full of grace and the ability to forgive and forget. You are a woman of character and integrity, always doing the right thing even when no one else is there to see. I'm so proud to have been able to call you mine all of these years. I promise to always put you first and to support your goals and aspirations. I promise to raise a family that loves God and cares for the needs of others. I promise to never stop learning about you and seeking a deep relationship with you. I promise to always be loyal and faithful to you, never breaking that commitment you and I made so many years ago. I promise no matter what life throws our way, through the good and the bad, I will be there for you. Jesse Kenneth, my very, very best friend. You have absolutely no idea how much you mean to me. Throughout our relationship, you have continually made me feel loved and cherished, sought after and protected. From the very first day that I met you, it has been obvious to me that you have a unique and tender heart for others, as evidenced by the fact that on that first day, even though I was a stranger to you, and a very dorky one at that, <laughs> you gave your lunch to me when you noticed I had none, and you've continued to bless me with that same self-sacrificing, gracious love ever since, and I've continued to eat all of your food. <laughs> you are selfless, faithful, generous, kind, brave, adventurous, and so full of excitement. Everyone who knows you knows that you live life to the absolute extreme. So when you love, you love fiercely and with all that you have. And I'm so grateful that I get to be loved by you in that way. Today, I promise to love you back just as intensely for the rest of my life. I declare that Jesse Allen and Sarah Bentley, having consented together to be in holy marriage and having pledged their faith to each other, demonstrating the same by giving and receiving a ring, are now husband and wife. That which God has joined together, let no man or woman ever separate. Jesse, you may kiss your wife. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's my privilege to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Jesse Allen. face challenges together from here forward as a married couple, you will have to make a choice. In this situation, will I honor God? Will I uphold my marriage vows? Will I choose to love? Will I choose to forgive? Will I be humble in this situation or stay proud? We make choices every day in the things that we do and the things that we say, and these choices have an impact on our lives. The good thing is, you are not alone. Everyone here is here to support you in your marriage together. <laughs> <laughs>